Basically, we was all in the caravan mind our own business. Mark decided to have a shower, so he decided to fart. And as he farted, he himself. Men don't talk enough to each other, and I've always been a big ad advocate for that. I always have a chat with my pals, always. I'm, I'm, I'm never ashamed to talk about what I'm going through, ever. It's important. You know what happened with Georgia? Yeah? Not really, no. Yeah, so, pregnant. We told everyone on the Monday. On the Sunday, she's bleeding. Literally, though, but it was, it was naughty, yeah? So, got a scan the next day. They said everything's all good. Leave there, Georgia's still bleeding now, yeah? So she's like, there's definitely something wrong here. They, they Does can't she feel all right be good. herself or? No. So we go to another clinic, and they was like, yeah, this ain't good news. The sack's too small for the baby. Really? Yeah, yeah? Mom, I don't even know what none of this stuff is. Imagine it, she's telling me. I'm just trying to act like I know what's going on for Georgia. Do you know what happened? We got the scan. She got so attached to the baby straight away. She will do. She named it. the baby and everything, man. She's named it? Named the baby, yeah. She's named the baby, she's bought clothes for the baby and stuff like that. And when I open the back of her car and see like baby bags on the back seat, like, I had to hide them the day after we got the bad news. I can't plan the wedding without knowing she's gonna be here. Do you know what I mean? I just don't feel right. Like, she's in my plans. She's the wedding with Brody. They're both like cute. Do you know what I mean? She's in a dress, he's in a tux. So I can't be doing any planning until I know that she's safe. I planned a family day out to get us out of the house. And we're going to the aquarium. Oh, I love the aquarium. Brody loves the aquarium. <gasps> wow! When I see Tommy and Brody this close, it just makes me so happy because Brody has been going through the clingiest of clingiest stages and he only wants me. But I think Tommy takes it a bit personal and it really affects his confidence. Look, look Stingray, look. Look at him, Whoa. look. Look at him. He's fast. Whoa. Yeah. I'm just so glad that their bond is back and that I get like five minutes of peace. What happened to Easter Brody? We go caravan! Woo! Caravan's open for the season. I'm only going for a couple of days, but you know, when you've got a kid. I am so particular of Brody and his stuff. If the thought of like forgetting something for him would upset me, yeah, so. Well overdone it. What are you going to do if he falls in a puddle, or a hurricane comes, or snow comes? Sorry, I just didn't see the hurricane on the on the <laughs> trip on the thing here, or, or snow. To be fair, you never know with the English weather, Tom. It is a global warning. <laughs> but I have such happy memories down here as a kid. I just want Brody to have exactly the same. I felt so free here as a kid, and I think it's the most important thing for me is to make sure that he has a good childhood, like I did. Lee, remember. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> it's nice being there and taking our mind off of, like, waiting for these results to come back. Obviously, it's still in the back of our minds, and it's still being brought up here and there, but we're not just sitting there all day thinking about it, so coming here was a really good idea. <gasps> Shows your bonnet! Yeah. Woo! Times like this, family's so important. So important. Like, without family, you ain't really got much of you. It's like, to get through these, man, these sort of times, you just need good people around you. And you can always rely on your family, can't you? We've got a good family, haven't we? Yeah, man. Wow. Oh, ring, man. <laughs>